Hey guys, welcome to Master Switch Designs. My name is Ray's Master, and today I'm going to be talking about the top three Google Chrome extensions that you need as a Merch by Amazon designer. These extensions will help you manage your designs and give you a broader overview of your sales stats. So without wasting any more time, let's get right into it. Go. So the first Google Chrome extension that I want to show you guys is called Pretty Merch for Merch by Amazon. Um, the reason why I love this uh, I, I love this extension is because of the beautiful design that it has and the way it shows you your sales and the way it shows you your designs. So I'll show it to you on my old Merch by Amazon account. Um, you can see it adds on right here onto your uh, right beside your old dashboard. You can click it right here and it takes you to the pretty much extension page. Um, it, it has a really beautiful display. You can see the today's sales. You can see the amount of designs. You can see the amount of products that sold, the, uh, the ones that canceled, uh, the ones that returned. You can see the estimated royalty you're going to earn for that day. Um, you can also see uh, your live products. So I only have one product live in this account. Um, I'm also a uh, tier 10. It has really these, it has really uh, cool um, characters that show you for different merch levels and as you grow up um, it also celebrates with you uh, when you advance to different merch levels really really cool um, it, can show, it shows you uh, the products that would sell it shows you the amount of products that you uploaded today um, it also shows you your overall reviews on all your products um, it, it's really helpful to see how you're doing and how, how your reviews are um, you can see how many sales you made yesterday in the last seven days and it's it's overall a really really good extension just to see how your sales are doing um, uh, it, it, it divides the, your sales by uh, country so this is for the US uh, UK uh, Germany and etc for all the same for all the different countries uh, you can see your sales and how they're doing um, this is currently the free account uh, the free version of it um, you can upgrade to pro for I think it's seventy nine dollars for the whole year, and about eight dollars um, per month. Um, it's up to you. Um, as 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 if you if you really like this uh, um, free uh, free tool, uh, you can pay that much money, and you can go to the full uh, the pro version where you can um, analyze your sales and see how you're doing, and and just get better sets on on your sales. Um, also, you can see. Um, uh, a great description of, of the products that you currently have live. So with the free version of uh, Pretty Merch, you can see about you can see up to 500 products that you've listed. Um, if, if you want to upgrade to that, uh, it goes on to um, how many products you have. Um, so as you can see, I only have one product uh, we actually, which we uploaded in the previous video. Go check that out if you haven't. I'll put a link maybe here or here. I'm not sure. So this is a product here. You can see um, that it hasn't sold yet. Um, you can see when it will last sale, how much reviews it has, uh, the best seller ratings. So you can see how many days it has until renewal. Um, it has a great description. Uh, it, it shows a great description of the product that you have for sales. It's easier to manage than your old dashboard and your old uh, manage page. So I'd highly recommend you download this extension if you haven't so already. So the second extension that I want to show you guys today is Productor for Merch by Amazon. Um, this extension is a little bit more complicated than Pretty Merch, but it is 100% lot more helpful. And if you really want to see um, how your sales are doing, really want to manage um, your products, I would 100% recommend that you download Productor for Merch by Amazon. Um, as you can see in my old uh, merch, in my old Merch by Amazon account. Um, it's right here on the right hand side, um, Productor uh, Dashboard, Productor Manage, Productor Stats. Um, these are all from the Productor uh, Google Chrome extension. So as you can see, it has a lot of stats, but it is clustered all together. So it might be a little difficult in, in the beginning, but as soon as you get used to it, it is much more helpful than pretty much. Um, you can see over here this blank space is when you start getting sales and you see uh, different sales for different countries really really helpful um, uh, One thing that um, Pretty merch doesn't have that merch by Amazon does uh, sorry 
pretty much doesn't have but Productor has is the upcoming events tab. Um, you can easily see which events are coming up uh, in, in the next week, in, in three weeks, in six weeks, or in, in, in greater than six weeks. Um, so this, this will give you an idea of uh, things that you can make your new designs on. Um, let's say, for example, here in 16 days, we have um, International Day of Yoga. Um, so maybe you can make a yoga design for maybe 2021. And um, so I usually get a lot of my ideas by going through uh, this list over here, maybe go through it uh, once, a, once a week uh, to see if I have any designs that I want to make. Something else that I really like about the Productor uh, extension is this little tab over here in the bottom. Um, you can see that it shows you uh, the, most the most searched keywords with the word shirt. So in the last 24 hours, so you can see over here, um, Taco Bell Hawaiian shirt has been searched. Um, the searches have gone up about 3,700%. Um, you can see Kildozer shirt has gone about 1,000% up. Um, I usually get a lot of my ideas from uh, these searches over here. Um, and these searches are divided by country. So for the US, uh, these are the top uh, searches that are going on with the word shirt. Um, for Germ for uh, Great Britain, UK, uh, these are the searches that are currently going around. So you can see NASA t-shirt, uh, which we obviously can't make um, in Merch for Amazon. Um, so James Daisy t-shirt and etc. and on and on. And this goes on for the other countries as well. You can also uh, change the keyword that you'd want to see. So if you go t-shirt and you search for that and it will change accordingly for that for a, for a t-shirt. So it says Chrome Hearts t-shirt. Maybe you can look that up, see what it is. And if, it's, um, if it doesn't have a copyright, you can start making that for your merch by Amazon. But by far, the best feature for Productor is when you go into Create and you go into um, making a new design. Uh, this is when Productor really uh, becomes helpful. So as you can see, uh, this is a little bit changed from uh, the previous Create tab that you have. Um, this is due to the Productor uh, Google Chrome extension that you have. Um, so let's say um, you want to design a t-shirt and you write a title, you write the brand. I'll just copy um, uh, a brand or something from somewhere else. As you can see this t-shirt over here, so we'll copy the title. Uh, we'll just copy the title, we'll paste it into our um, design over here. Uh, we also, it uh, doesn't have a, um, it doesn't have a, um, it doesn't have a bullet point or it doesn't have a description. So we're just gonna leave that blank, blank for now. Uh, we'll also copy the brand and we'll see. I'll just put it in here. So why I really love uh, Productor is because of this feature right here. So if you go into Trademark um, uh, US and you click that and it will search if there are any trademarks for that uh, listing that you have done. So as you can see, Princess Consuela Banana Hammock has orange, is, is being highlighted orange. Uh, while uh, this brand name hasn't been highlighted anything. So orange means that it's a single word trademark, for example, Disney. And if it has a red, that means um, that it is a double or multi-word trademark. So for example, Mickey Mouse. So Princess Consuela Banana Hammock, each singly are, have a trademark in the US. Um, you can sometimes um, publish products with single oranges but I wouldn't recommend doing that if you're on a lower tier level. Um, if, if you have any, any orange, um, on, or orange highlights, I'd recommend that you go back and try to change those words into something else or because that can lead to a rejection and, and you would. Um, another thing about uh, Productor extension is the Productor Manage tab. Um, you can see all your designs over here. Uh, you can see the type. Uh, the brand, your title, uh, the bullet points, the price, uh, you can see the colors, you can see key, uh, the keywords that you use, um, and a lot more detail. So as I, as I previously said, um, this extension is a little bit more complicated, but um, has a lot more in-depth uh, uh, in detail of, of all, your, um, all, your, all your designs.
Um, if you go into sales over here, it has a really beautiful display of all the sales. Um, you can see the sales by fit, uh, the top colors that are sale, the, the top colors that are selling. Um, you can see uh, the top products. Uh, this is really helpful once you start getting sales. Uh, the top keywords by sale, um, really, really good. Um, uh, your current month, your current month sales, your previous months, um, and just a lot more detail. Uh, you can also uh, select over here, see how your sales were doing the last 30 days, 60 days, and whatnot. The third and last extension I want to show you guys today is the Amazon Quick View extension. Um, I went over this in my previous video a little bit but this is a little bit more in-depth of it. Of it. Um, this extension will help you uh, see if a design that you want to do is good um, in terms of it getting a sale. So um, if, you, if you download it from here, I'll, I'll link all the, um, uh, the links in the description below. So if you download this extension over here, you can see it um, as soon as you go into Amazon and you look for a look for a product, uh, you can see that if you go into not newer survivals, we'll go from our average customer review. Let's go here. So, so yeah, we can see um, this T-shirt over here. Um, so this is what you can see with the uh, Amazon Quick View Chrome extension. Uh, you can see the best seller ratings. Uh, this is about 600,000, which is really good. Um, uh, you, can see, you can see all of these information. Uh, so if you have a similar design and um, you, you want to use some of the keywords that this design has used, so quickly go down here and you can see all the focus keywords and you can add them to your listings in order to uh, make the, your design appear along with this design. Um, you can see that 100,000 for this t-shirt, um, a really good uh, BSR rating. So uh, the lower the BSR rating, uh, the more likely it has, uh, the more recently this product is sold. Um, so 100,000 is, is, is a really good rating. Uh, 400,000 is great. So I would say anything um, below uh, 500, 600,000 is, is, uh, is a great BSR rating. And if you have list listings, so the amount of listings is the amount of results are low in your specific niche and you have high BS, uh, low BSR ratings, so like let's say 600,000, 400,000, then definitely that is a niche that you want to design in and um, you are most likely to get those sales. So that's it for today, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Um, if you like this video, uh, please hit the like button, please subscribe and uh, leave a comment if you have any improvements or if you want me to make a video of something else. Thank you.